you can't give them too much to think about. But how you get to those little finer things is something that, frankly, you need a little bit of wit, right? And sometimes it's like a smart-ass comment that you have to make. <laughs> and yep. sometimes sometimes it's just like, hey, bud, <laughs> you know? I mean, may- maybe instead of doing that, like, do this, right? And it's just you, you need to figure out how to, like, find the one thing. Like, find what what is the linchpin in, like, this error chain that's making this fall apart? And focus on that, right? One thing at a time. Uh, big fan of that. Shame and sarcasm have a place in coaching. They do. Some oh, of the best sure. coaches I've ever had are, are snarky people. Yeah. Uh, and they use the humor to kind of drive points home, right? Yeah. I had one thinking, right? I had one uh, instructor pilot when I got to my operational unit who was like, did, did you go to pilot training? Were you there when we talked about this in pilot training? Like, <laughs> that, that drove a point home for me, right? Uh, but it, it's got a, it's got a place up to a point. If that becomes your brand, uh, that's probably a problem. And all of that has to be done with humor and with love and understand that a lot of people have a hard time finding the humor and love on getting called out. 